Oh, can you just hold it up while I talk? Today, we are here for the gathering and death of many people's hearts. Billy Combs, he died today from a terrible incident that happened in first period. He was smashed with a hydro flask and a chip came out of his skull and he now suffers severe brain damage, malaria, and Ebola. <laughs> Here is where we'll bury him. And we have refreshments in the back for when the funeral is over. And uh, would anybody like to come up and say something about Billy before I start? I just can't. It's okay. Here is my eulogy. At the end of every day, as he rests from his labors, every father asks himself, have I made my Billy proud? Did I make his world at least a little better? Ever a caring father, days later, it was a very difficult time in my life. Business couldn't have been better, but it had been seven hours since Billy had first been diagnosed, and he was still battling with the resulting complications of malaria and Ebola. But I felt something else while I was there too. I didn't want to admit it right away, but I felt that a hole I have been missing for a very long time. So I kept going back and I could see the difference it was making for Billy. I would always hurt Billy's, or hurry to Billy's portable hospital after a long mod at school. What time he got better after many prayers, but then he unexpectedly croaked. And it was a very sad time. <laughs> I was I was burying my son. You're burying your son? Yes. He died from malaria and Ebola and brain damage. Lovely. I'll call you back later. You're crazy. I'm not crazy. I'm live streaming it right now. You're what? I'll talk to you later. 
she's right here watching the burial. <laughs> No, I, I have to go. I, I have to go. Well, I need to talk to her. I will call you in like five minutes, I promise. Bye. Okay. Bye. 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 Hey. <laughs> we have now successfully buried my son into the ground of nature. Rest in peace, Billy. <laughs> and you are all free to go have some refreshments.